I'm John Harris along with Dr. Mike Gustafson. Red Raiders win the opener on Friday night. Gus, very timely hitting. And boy, an outstanding performance by starting pitcher Andrew Morris. Runs in six doubles. Hits that one pretty well straight away. Center field coming on for it. Dominic Johnson trying to make a diving catch, but it's off the glove. Jace is racing to second base. Throw is going to be cut off, and Jace Young, a two-out shot into center field. The error committed by Kansas State. That's most in the Big 12. And here's Kurt Wilson. Long ball hit into left field, and it's out of here. The error cost Kansas State as Kurt Wilson steps up and blasts his seventh home run of the year and add three more runs batted in to the Red Raiders leader in that category. A few change-ups in there. There's a three and one pitch hit pretty well by Hudson White. It's out of here. Tom Hughes gave chase for a moment but realized he wasn't going to get to that one and the Red Raiders have their second home run of the afternoon as Hudson White blast one out of here leading off in the top of the or the bottom of the second. Infield. Trying to save a run, but Vuletic just rockets that one on the ground between Day and Goodwin there, between third and second base. And the Red Raiders have another run. Nice job by Vuletic. Coleman got that one, hit it right at third. Here's a throw home, down to first base. It's wide of the bag there. Throwing error by Mitchell behind the plate. It's going to score a couple of runs for the Red Raiders. Dylan Phillips had to run that ball down. Chase Young crosses the plate, and Ty Coleman is all the way around to third base. Base on balls, 58 struck out. Got him there, there's another. The inning is over as Dominic Johnson strikes out for the second time today. There's a ground ball to short. This could be a pair. Young bobbled the ball, still got it out of his glove, and got it to Hudson White at first base in time. And the Red Raiders do turn the 6-4-3 double play. Two batters. May have gotten that one too, and he does. Phillips swings through that for strike three. The 12th strikeout today for Brandon Birdsell. And after the leadoff walk, Red Raiders second baseman again. They're going to pay for it with at least one run. That ball's hit pretty well into center field. Johnson's there to make the play, but tagging at third and coming in to score is Vuletic. And Stillwell gets over to third on that sacrifice fly by Jace Young. Here it is again. Ground ball to short. Play is going to be at first base. Coleman is out, but Stillwell scores from third. The Red Raiders add to their lead. Ground ball to third. Parker Kelly backed up, bobbled it for a moment. Throw over is in time as Hudson White stretches off the bag there. And Nick Goodwin is out to start this seventh inning. <laughs> Kelly walks. That'll get another run across for the Red Raiders. One out. That ball hit him. Pearson delivers one that hits Hunt down in the lower portion of his leg, and that'll score a run. Hoping to preserve a shutout. Here's a ground ball towards Wilson and short. There's one over to Hudson White. This ball game is over. Kansas State grounds into their second double play of the ball game. They lead the Big 12 in that category, and the Red Raiders get the win.